Don't tell me he's going to have a deliberate shot. Surely not. Just kick one. What's he going to do here? Johnson screws the ball around the body for number five. Just have a look at this. Stevie Johnson, look at all the Adelaide players lining up. He's arguing with the umpire about where he should take it from. He's saying they've got to be back further than they are. They're within about three metres. Johnson plays on and kicks it around the goal. Swings around. Opens up the angle as easy as you like. Johnson has a look and finishes the job. Johnson, always clever. I think it's just snapping balls is something I've always practised. I mean, if you ask me how many drop punts I've had, it could be shots of goal I've had it over growing up and since I've been at a club. I'd say snapshots would be it'd be 10 to 1 how many shots I've had. So it slips around, it goes through at about head high. Steve Johnson, what a truly in his domain there. Yeah. Johnson screws the ball around the body for number five. Then traps it on the left foot. It's a Stevie special. It's just about feeling comfortable. I don't have to think about my technique or what I'm doing. It just comes naturally um, to me now. And I don't think we have the time to actually do that with drop pucks. Front and centre, right foot snap, goal. You know, it takes a long time to go out there and practice kicking goals, and we just don't get the chance. Look at this. Oh, you cannot do that. Leisurely kick. It does gift an easy goal to the opposition. Well, if anyone can kick a goal, it'll be Stevie. If we walk to a walk around the band or something, we might have five quick snaps of goal. And, um, yeah, as I said, it just it feels comfortable to me, and I'm used to it. Don't tell me he's going to have a deliberate shot. Surely not. Let's kick one. What's he going to do here? He's going to kick around the corner from 45 metres out. It's coming back. You are a genius, Steve Johnson. Tommy had taken a couple of big grabs um, in that final quarter and you could tell after the second um, missed shot that you know if he took another one there'd be a, a fair bit of pressure on him. Yeah, so I took a mark, I think I was about 15 metres out uh, on an angle. Oh, I had a couple of shots before that and I'd missed a few so um, uh, I, I took the mark. Um, and Jimmy and Stevie were both in my era and Jimmy came up first and he said, which he always says if he's around me, he comes up and says, go back and keep the goal. His kick's um, swinging a, bit, a little bit left to right, I noticed, and uh, when he marked the ball in that left-hand pocket, I thought it might be actually, you know, the goals might look a lot skinnier, knowing that he'd missed a couple of shots previously. So I went over to him and I said, Tommy, I think you should kick a snap just to give him something else to think about instead of having to go back and knowing that he missed two drop punts just previously. I looked around and he said, he said kick a snap and there was no one around us. I said to Stevie, how about you kick it? And anyway, he's right there and I don't think he was really expecting it, but uh, handballed it to him and, and he kicked the goal. He looked at me and he said, uh, Stevie, you kick it. I had a quick look around and said, all right, give it to me. Looking back, I probably could have kicked it myself, but um, Stevie's uh, Stevie, Stevie, and he's known for his uh, for his uh, magical work. So um, you knew, I knew it was uh, a definite goal. So um, I suppose it was one of those things that gets talked about a bit, but um, you know, um, it's gone down to six points, and he handballs to Johnson, who kicks the goal, and it gave us a, a bit more of an edge in front. So that was what was happening. I didn't go over there expecting him to give me the handball or say, quick, give it to me. Um, he decided that was the best thing for the side. And I don't know if it was because maybe he thought his confidence was low or, or the percentage of me putting it through might have been higher, but um, it worked out well. And Mick 
Bolthouse often does it. He can stick to his structures and he, he plays on. Johnson. He handballs to Johnson, who kicks the goal. Quick kick, Salwood to Steve Johnson. Wouldn't this be sweet for Steve Johnson? After the week he's had, he's kicked three already. He's going for his snap putto as he likes to. Well, seven days ago, he must have thought he was no chance to be here. But this is where he is, on the main stage, kicking the match-winning goal. How sweet it is.